Hey loves, it's Bona Celine and today's video is going to be all about home decor for your bathroom. So I'm going to show you guys two different bathrooms, our master bath and also our guest bathroom and they're both completely different styles. I went according to the paint color that was already on there. We had just recently painted our kitchen, our master bedroom and then also um, the cabinets. So I had to slow it down. I couldn't paint all the rooms all at once. I'm like, you know what, I'm going to work with these colors and you know, challenge myself to the decor of each one. So the first bathroom that I want to share with you guys is going to be the guest bath. I really wanted to bring a lot of greenery in there because the walls are yellow and it was extremely challenging and also like warmer tones. I wanted it to have really natural elements like wood and rope and plants even though they're not real. I still wanted them to stand out a lot. First thing that I saw was this cute little basket which I plan to put behind the toilet. I also plan to get like a cute little like ladder or something to be able to um, put like any of the stuff for the guests, whether it's like bar soap, decorations, toilet paper, or anything like that. And so I got this right here for the toilet paper and then maybe some handhelds. I don't know what I want to do with it yet, but I really like the wood on here. This I found at Marshalls, it was $12.99. I also got this really cute vase of flowers and I love how it looks. This might actually go behind the toilets. I also got two shower curtains. You're probably wondering, why do you have two? And that is because on Pinterest, I actually saw that they use these like on each side and so they hung them like curtains and then they tied them so it looks really nice and pretty we are not going to be using the guest bathroom as much so I think it'll look really nice for display and they were actually a really good price because I'm really picky when it comes to patterns and these were only $15 I also went above and beyond on Hannah and so I'm not gonna lie I did search all over the counters for something that would display really nicely and something that was going to smell really good and just look really good in the bathroom so I went with these I found them at home goods I want to say and these are peach and honey hand wash and lotion the matching lotion you guys are going to laugh at me but I even went all out on the toilet brush cleaner I know I know but I wanted to look really nice in there and I like that it had like this pattern it just looked really cool and it matches the curtains that we got for the shower this is going to go on the countertop there's a his and her sink and so there's plenty of space for me to put stuff in there all right I'm so excited about this bad boy right here I love that it's concrete and it has like the gold on there and I don't know these are just different they look real, even though they're not, and they kind of feel real too. This is the main baby right here. This is going to be the main display. The walls are yellow, so I'm like, I really want to bring in all like the greenery and like the grays, and so I thought this was perfect. I found this. When did I find you, Pete? I found you at TJ Maxx, and it was only twenty dollars, and it's made out of wood. So the guest bathroom is a Jill and Jack bathroom. Is that what it's called? Like when there's the sink is separated from the toilet and the bath and then it goes into the hallway and it goes into the room so there's two entrances. I think that's what it's called. And so in the bath, it's separated from the vanity. So if someone is using the vanity or the sink, you can't get into the bath if they have the door closed. So I wanted so much to display the towels by making them look nice and pretty. And so I didn't just want to have um, towels on the hooks. I wanted them to actually be displayed and make it feel more like a little bit of a spa. And so I wanted to put the towels in here and they're gonna be white so they stand out so I just ran upstairs to go get some stuff from the master bathroom dude I need to work out all right get it together Belinda so up next we have it the master bathroom and that one was also a challenge because the vanity or the countertop cabinets were in oak color and I just cannot stand the oak. The hardware was so outdated and so I really wanted to spruce it up. Like we have this gorgeous bathroom and it really needed to stand out. So we painted the cabinets. I really wanted to like step out of my comfort zone and I absolutely love how it turned out. And so I really need to get some really cool stuff to bring that blue into the rest of the bathroom that the cabinets were. And so I found these at Joanne Fabrics. I put them by the hot tub and so I got two of them and then I put a plant in the middle and then I also found this right here because I wanted somewhere to put the towels because the linen closet is is not that far away from the shower but of course you don't want to get all of the um, floor wet when you're getting out of the shower and so I wanted something to be right next to the shower I also wanted a little table in there to put like a book to put like your towel to put some candles just to make it a little bit more romantic and then I went to Joanne Fabrics and I found this the exact same color that I needed all this stuff was on clearance which was a bonus this is a little bit heavy so if it falls on my head you guys are probably gonna see that this is actually a bin where you can put like 
blanket or I don't know what you can put in here to be honest but I think this was like living room decor but I converted it into a little table and it looks so good in there you cannot even tell that it's supposed to be a bin. It looks like a table. And then I found these mats at Walmart, which I was really surprised because I wanted something that was padded and it matches all the decor. It matches the design on the bin. It matches the towels that I bought for it. It's like that navy blue. I actually just came back from shopping. I got a bunch of new things. Some of them are gonna go into the master bath over there. It looks really yellow over there. So I wanted something for the top of the vanity. And so I found this at Marshalls for $12.99. This I found at TJ Maxx for $6.99. And this is actually gonna go into my office. The office is going to be pink and gold. And so I thought it would match perfectly. This is from Ross and I just got some hand towels. I really like this color a lot. It was only $4 for all of these. So that was nice. This is so gorgeous. This is gonna go on top of the vanity with the flowers and the towels. I thought that was really nice. Okay, so I got this for the other bathroom. I found this at Hobby Lobby and look how adorable it is. So it's for the guest bathroom and it says, be our guest. So cute. We have that big wall over here that I didn't know what to put in yet um, until I found those. I couldn't commit to any artwork. I just didn't like any of it. I searched for like a month, um, but I found these and there's four of them. They're two different patterns and I'm going to put them side by side. It's going to look really nice. That is all for my video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Please give it a big thumbs up if you did. And also subscribe to my channel so you don't miss out on more home decor videos. And I'll show you guys the rest of the house and updates on how everything is coming along. And I'll talk to you guys next time. Which is this.